The summer season brings with it scorching sun rays and waves of heat. From refreshing drinks to relaxing holidays, we do everything we can to protect ourselves in these months. And the use of sunscreens is also very common. Those numerous sunscreen brands might protect us from the harsh sun rays, but they are also affecting the environment adversely. Chemicals found in sunscreens are getting washed and then contaminating the sea grass that's found in the Mediterranean Sea. Let's tell you more. A new study has found traces of ultraviolet ray filters used in sunscreens. In the stems of a seagrass species populating the Mediterranean region, the chemicals that were found have different scientific names, but simply put, they comprise of the components we find in popular sunscreen products. While the exact impact of these chemicals is yet to be studied, researchers point out that sunscreens affect photosynthesis in seagrass uh, sea grasses and can hamper the functioning as well. The seagrass species forms meadows which provide shelter to various marine species and also protect the coastal areas from erosion. Sea grasses are extremely crucial in the Mediterranean and accumulation of these chemicals can disrupt the ecological, ecological balance. Tourists flocking the Mediterranean region bask under the sun. The sunscreen eventually ends up in the sea. Researchers are convinced that such contamination is the result of tourist activities in these regions. Earlier, research has shown how UV-absorbing chemicals affect fish, dolphins, turtles, coral reefs as well. It disrupts their re reproductive systems and even halts their development. Owing to such adverse effects, many states like those of Florida, Hawaii, have prohibited the use of such products near the coastal areas. And similar laws in Mediterranean countries are yet to be introduced. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.